So over here, this is all my hardware storage area. I've got electrical connectors, air fittings, wolf cookie, shrink wrap, screws, hooks, nails, razor blades, everything over here. But I feel I can maximize this area a whole lot more than what it is. And I was waiting for one final thing, and that was the sandpaper storage. Uh, one of the guys in one of the groups I'm in offered it up for free, just had to pay for shipping. So with this here, I've got a bunch of OSB cutoffs and some scrap MDF I want to use. And I'm going to redo the whole area. I'm going to move this shelf. I'm going to re get rid of these shelves, redo this drill bit area, get rid of these Star Wars things I made. Because I need more storage. Small shop, more storage. You can see I got. I moved some clamps up on the ceiling to free up another wall. So the glues and stuff are going to go in a separate spot. So we're just going to, going to redo this whole area. Wanted to film it. Want to share it with you guys. Give you some ideas on how to maximize storage. All these bins I got from Harbor Freight, super cheap. These ones are two different sets, which were like 12 bucks a piece. And this whole thing here with the blue ones was like 20 bucks. So these are a good investment, so let's just, let's get to it. Yeah!
that's about it. Um, the main reason I did it was to get a little more organized and just kind of declutter. Having it on those little racks, it worked, but it just kind of, for me, it just didn't look right. It was Some of them were uneven. It just didn't fit right. It was a pain coming off and on. So here it's just straight on the shelf, plenty of access to it. I didn't measure anything. All I measured was the depth of these. And I cut everything five inches by five inches. So you got five inches here, five inches there, which is perfect depth for all these. Even these big ones, they just have a bunch of random stuff in. They fit nice right there. All my sandpaper here, glues, more glues, uh, some grinding discs. I got all kinds of stuff. All my hardware related things are all right here. All my drill bits are here. I still have the bottom area. I need to go around, add some shelves to get some more space in there for other things. But for the most part, it's pretty much exactly the way I want it. I still got room up here. Put another shelf to get these up higher. So that way, when I get some more sanding blocks, they're going to go up here. So for now, it works. But like I said at the beginning of the video, all these little bins are from Harbor Freight. I bought. Two of these gray packs were 10 bucks each, and the big, these bigger blue ones with these red ones were 20 bucks. So $40 for those, and then scrap wood to have this. I can't argue. I'm happy with it. It works out. Hope you guys liked it. Hope it gave you guys some ideas. I'll put some pictures at the end of the video, some, a couple shots of everything. But thanks for watching.